All right, here we got dogs and infernos at round 25, and look at that. Boom, 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 boom. Round 25. Hey guys, Johnny here back with another Call of Duty mobile video. We will be opening some crates today because we got two new lava weapons for zombies in COD Mobile. So you guys, if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know I don't buy everything that comes out. I didn't buy the last two lucky draws. I didn't buy the Christmas offers. I passed on a lot of stuff recently. It's been a while since I did a real crate opening video. But once again, don't expect me to spend a thousand bucks today. I don't do that. So I will open some crates. If I get lucky, I get lucky. If I don't get lucky, well, just so be it. So guys, let's look into it. We got two new weapons and they are wonder weapons and zombies. We got the ICR-1 lava. This looks really, really cool. And this is the one I want the most for real for zombies, not for multiplayer. I didn't see gameplay yet. I really hope we can get that one, guys. Now, the next one is the KRM lava and the special power doesn't look as good as the other one, but I don't know. We'll look into it if we get it. So uh, yeah, before we buy the crates, guys, we have some special offers and we will get some free crates just for buying cut points. So uh, there's a purchase event. And if you buy cut points, they give you a, a new baseball bat, a bunch of skins and 13 crates like that. So before buying crates, I'll buy cut points and we will get some crates at the same time. There's also a first time purchase. Anytime you buy any cut points, they will give you a new BK57 Mardi Gras. So let's buy some COD points first and see what we get. So here's the first time purchase reward. If you guys buy any amount of COD points after the new update, you will get that for free as a bonus. And it's pretty dope. I don't know how good the BK57 will be with the new balance changes, but it was always kind of good, not so bad. And this one looks pretty dope, honestly. I really love that skin. And here we got the baseball bat cashback event. Uh, Mad Clown is the first baseball bat in the game and we got 13 crates to open. So let's start with the free crates and see if we can get lucky before buying more. All right, here we go. 13 at once. Fingers crossed. Oh, that would be epic. So a BK57 to start. It's a rare one. And that is it. A bunch of credits, guys, like 45 for the duplicates, but 400 on top. So yeah, um, BK57 to start and I will go for the season three platinum crates 10 at a time. It's a bit expensive, but once again, when I see something I really like, uh, I'll take a chance. I'll try my luck. I got tons of cut points. I'm willing to spend everything, but I'm not buying more today, guys. So yeah, if we don't get lucky, it's going to be pretty sad, but that's going to be it. So let's go with our first 10. Let's do this. We start with smoke grenade again and that's it so first 10 not so lucky let's go 10 again can buy about a hundred crates nothing here guys a bunch of credits that's gonna be 30 crates now oh no it's an arctic 50 i thought that was it guys and that's it again. So 10 more. I stopped counting, but that was 30, right? So that's going to be 40. 40 crates. Nothing. 50. Grenade. Nope. It's going to be 60. No. Come on, baby. Now, 70 crates, guys. Nope. That's a lot of crates, boys and girls. 80 crates now. Mm, fried grenade. Again. Mm, there you go. But it's not the ICR-1. It's the shotgun. I think it's a shotgun, right? KRM. So there's one, guys, one of the new uh, wonder weapons in zombies. So let's keep going and see if we can get the ICR-1. Grenades. Nope. Nope. 
I think we can get 20 more, guys. Oh, no. It's the M4 LMG. So let's go for the last 10. It's not gonna happen, guys. So, we will go for some gameplay, guys, with the new lava weapon in Zombies. Okay, so we'll go for some Zombies. We didn't get lucky with the ICR lava, but we got the new KRM. So, we will check it out and see how the new power works. Uh, it's not clear, but it says, yeah, enemies are outlined when damaged. And if you outline an enemy three times, they will explode. So, I don't know if you have to outline the same enemy or three different zombies and they will all explode it's not clear so let's check it out and we'll also see if we can get the different lava weapons at the same time in the box we will also check out the brand new baseball bat for fun let's see how it looks like all right here's the bat oh you hold it with two hands like that it's a pretty weird grip i don't think that's how you play baseball but yeah switching the the grip for hitting Hey guys, we'll let them enter and see if we can one shot or one hit kill. Yeah, of course. At round one, I was gonna. Oh, the range though, guys. I think it's very short range. You have to be close, like a knife, kind of. See? And that was. Yeah, it doesn't have range. It's just like a knife, I guess. But yeah, different animation. Not bad at all. Not a big fan of melee weapons anyway, so. I'm gonna keep going and go for the box. All right, end of round two. Let's go for the box. First shot at the box. Usually, first weapons. This is just to do a few rounds, but let's see. With two wonder weapons in the box, how long it's gonna take? Okay, so not yet. I'm gonna do a few rounds, I guess. Get some points. Play with the box again. All right, so we got eight thousand points. Should be able to do a few spins, and let's see what we get now. Oh, there you go, guys. Round six, and we got the brand new KRM. We're gonna shoot the last zombie, get some buffs, and go for another round. I wanna see the active power, really, how it works, how long it lasts, what exactly is the highlight thingy. So let's let them spawn, and we're gonna shoot in the pack. All right, so we got a pack of 10 zombies. Let's activate the special skill. See the explosion? Wow. So yeah, when you damage a few zombies and you got three different, they all explode. We're gonna have to try again, guys. Looking pretty interesting. And my skill is ready for round seven again. So I think you can use it pretty much every round. And it's gonna be interesting at high rounds when the zombies get lots of HP. You know you're gonna highlight. You know when you have a full pack, just run around the pack, highlight everything, and they're all gonna explode, I guess. So let's try again, guys. Okay, use the power. Then boom, boom, boom. Man, I don't know. They didn't seem to kill that many zombies. I really don't know, and I don't really see the highlight. We're gonna have to check again. How about the fire rate? Maybe it's the same zombie you have to highlight three times. I will try again right now. Shoot the same pack. One, two, three. Oh. Well, that was better than shoot the same direction three times. And the fire rate looking pretty good. I'm going to try holding my, my finger on the trigger next time. And by the way, the cooldown is pretty short. So this is round nine. We're going to have some brutes. So let's try it on these guys. Let everything spawn. Activate power. And shoot these dudes. Bruh. So you cannot leave your finger on the trigger. You have to spam it like that. And it's faster when you're active. When your power is active, the fire rate is faster. 
and make sure you real like check it out it's already uh ready to use again so you can use it very often and look at the fire rate when i'm not active you have to reload like that super slow and when i'm gonna activate my power check the difference in the fire rate all right let's go see you can pretty much spam it and you can you can clear a wave pretty much we'll, we'll see at higher rounds all right guys this is round 16 and we have the infernal boss they have tons of hp and just saying i got double tap now so after two shots uh, that's four bullets so probably the enemies will start exploding after two shots but like what i think is the regular zombies they seem to die but the big bosses or the mini bosses they they will just take extra damage from the explosion so let's see what it looks like right now keep shooting the pack see after two shots this is crazy dude it cleared the whole pack i went from 50 something to 38 uh, the infernal guys died and the whole pack of trash mobs died now let's see a full pack of trash mobs at round 16 and two shots one two and then it explodes every round i pretty much cleared the pack here guys so it doesn't take a lot of ammo compared to the ray gun for real so round 23 over guys and i think the new strat now will be maybe max your buffs and then go for double shotguns and see how far we can get with that yeah we got it guys and also the lava weapons are much easier to get than the ray gun so it's gonna be maybe more efficient early game all right, here we got dogs and infernos at round 25, and look at that. Boom, 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 boom. Round 25. We got six remaining. We can pretty much chill. Let them spawn and unload again. It's this easy mold, guys. Once again. Boom, boom, boom. And that's it. Easy peasy. Okay, guys, this is round 43. And this is the highest I ever been. And look at the damage. Okay. Boom, boom. And it still pretty much destroyed a whole pack. With... Yeah, with one, one full clip, right? And then... The cooldown like i said by the time you're done reloading your cooldown is halfway ready to use again so pretty much just gather them around and use again from 34 zombies to 24. so i destroyed like 11 zombies in one go and then make them spawn again reload Reloading is pretty long even with the, the speed cooler. But I'm at 23 zombies now. Pretty much ready to go again. And let's go again. I kind of missed a little bit here. But still, I did destroy more than 10 zombies again. And I'll keep the trap for next round. But still, it gives you a pretty good idea at higher rounds. I think it does as good as the ray gun or better for real but like if you guys play a lot of zombies let me know in the comments what's your impression or what's your idea here where's the last dude uh, and even without the power it's still dealing decent damage for real look if you go for headshots and then there's a double tap takes a few shots it's pretty good so that's it round 45 on my first attempt i beat my personal best i never did round 45 so i guess if i try again i can beat 45 again of course but first impression guys this gun is very very strong like i said as good or better than the ray gun maybe for clearing packs of trash mobs and i guess time will tell we'll need a bit more bit more practice 
see the the rewards at round 45 if they change the rewards oof 10 lava axe i never seen 10 purple shards on one run then six of each uh yeah they changed their reward system a little bit you can only have one per day now but i guess you can get more more purple shards at once so it's pretty good for real so guys that's it for the video i was really disappointed i didn't get icr1 lava but i'm very impressed with the krm shotgun and i think it might be the key for maybe new world records so check it out in the near future maybe some guys will yeah increase the world record on the leaderboards so thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoyed the video once again hit the like if you did please subscribe to the channel for more call of duty mobile videos and i'll see you guys later take care